Hey, what's up everyone? Frogman951 here. I'm here with some Demon's Souls on the PS5. Um, I've never played this game myself. Uh, I have seen, like, some videos on it though, so unfortunately I do know uh, some stuff, like about certain bosses and stuff like that. But besides that, I've never actually played this game. Uh, well, this version or the original version. Um, but I have played all the other, like, Souls games, the Dark Souls 1, 2, 3, and all that stuff. Um, so yeah, I know kind of how these games work. <laughs> um, but yeah, let's get into it and see how, uh, this game is. Been wanting to play it for a while. Um, now I did already go into the game to kind of test out the audio and stuff like that. So I already created my character, I have one made and everything. Uh, so that should go by pretty quickly since I already have a character saved. Um, but yeah, let's get into it. Uh, I'm actually going to be playing offline for this. Um, it's actually a female character that I created. And there she is. Retrieve. Um, I'm gonna go with what I went uh, with one of my other characters and I don't think it was Hunter that I picked the class um, I think I want to go for a strength sort of build uh, with this character so I'm not exactly sure if I should go with a barbarian here or uh, there was this other one that I saw I think it was was it soldier? No, it wasn't soldier, was it? It was one that had a uh, sort of decent, like, strength, but also a bit of dexterity. Um, I mean, maybe it was a uh, soldier. I mean, that one has 12 and 11. Um... I mean, I guess I'll go with Barbarian, since it has the highest strength. I mean, I don't know too much about the, like, weapons in this game. But, I mean, I kind of do want to go for a strength build. Uh, but alright, let's go ahead and pick that. And for this, I'm not exactly sure what I should pick. I mean, maybe this would be good. Find some more items the beginning the other ones are just like single use type of things um, I have no idea what this means right here stone that radiates a guiding light um, yeah I'll go ahead and, and go with the ring as my uh, starting thing alright um, I think I'm set right Think so. Let's get started then. King Alant the Twelfth, by channeling the power of souls, brought unprecedented prosperity to his northern kingdom of Boletaria. That is, until the colorless deep fog swept across the land. Boletaria was cut off from the outside world, and those who dared penetrate the deep fog never returned. But Valifax of the royal twin fangs broke free from the fog and told the world of Boletaria's plight. That the old King Alant had roused the old one, the great beast below the Nexus, from its eternal slumber. And that a colorless fog had swept in, unleashing terrible demons. The demons hunt down men and claim their souls. Those who lose their souls lose also their minds. The mad attack the sane and chaos reigns. Valifax also spoke of the enticing power of the demon souls. Each time a demon claims a human soul, the demon's own soul is invigorated by the life force 
And the power of a mature demon soul is beyond human imagination. The legend spread quickly. Mighty warriors lured by the possibilities braved the fisher to breach the accursed land. But none have returned. Pure of the Twin Fangs. Yet the silent chief. Saint Urbane. Skurva the Wanderer. The sixth Saint Astria with her knight Gal Vinland. And Sage Freak the Visionary. The colorless deep fog slowly creeps beyond Boletaria's borders. Humankind faces a slow and steady extinction. The deep fog will eventually swallow all lands near and far. But Boletaria has one final hope. A lone warrior who has braved the baneful fog. Oh, has the land found its savior? Or have the demons found a new slave? And as you can see, I've already played that part uh, while I was testing. <laughs> I kind of just skipped through it, so I ran uh, through it. So I'll go ahead and just Brave go through it slowly this time. I shall guide you to the fisher. So that you may lull the old one back to slumber. All right, outpost passage. Now, from what I uh, played while I was testing this, I did like the way it feels, like the combat and everything. I already have an enemy right here. Okay, I don't have too much range with this weapon, I guess. Yep. And you can actually jump in this game, huh? Like the other games. Don't think you can. do that so jumping attacks I don't think so I tried it right there it didn't do anything Okay, nothing over here. Oh. Okay, relax a little bit. No need for all that. Oh, that was like the... Like the same way you do a kick in the other games, like in the other Dark Soul games or whatever. But not a kick. I have no idea what the heck that is. <laughs> I'm pretty sure it does the same thing though, right? That like breaks a uh, their guard. They have a shield out. And that's something that uh, wasn't in the other games. Could vault over things. What does this say? Backstep and roll. Alright. Okay, what? 
This thing has like no range. <laughs> you have to be like right next to them. Let me see if I can parry this dude. Okay, um, I don't know if it works the same way as it does in the other games that I can't like parry jumping attacks. Probably that's what happened there. Okay, I'll go ahead and do a back attack then. <laughs> if you want to give me anything that I can parry. Should probably heal. That's heal, right? The, the grass there. That barely healed me. I think I was too early on that. And a little bit too late, I think. Okay, I need to be careful with this. You just try a few more times. Ooh, okay, uh, I guess you can. <laughs> I was just mistiming the parry, I guess. Okay, that's nice to know. I'm looking around to see if there's anything. Okay, I need to get the hang of this because I really do want to parry in this game. I'm doing it like way too early. Okay, I have to do it like right when it's about to hit. I'm only down to five more healings. Uh, grass or whatever the heck that's called. Oh, I got two more. Is there anything over here that I missed? Here's something. Didn't sound too good. <laughs> There's no way to go back. Yep. Strong attack. Okay, there's a different enemy. There's like a human. attacks real quick and there you go I won't pair you just finish you off like that mm -hmm. that's what I've been trying to do Oh my gosh, that damage. Oh. <laughs> 
Nice. <sighs> I'm running out of healing. Oh yeah, I almost forgot about that. <laughs> okay, it changes it. I think I like the two-handed better. I'm not sure if it has any more range. Getting it. Nope. I don't think I have anything else right now. Some half moon grass. Does that heal more or something? Let me see actually. Um... R1. Reasonably, it says. Maybe. <laughs> Can you, like, check, uh... Is there, like, more? Like, can you read more on it? Oh, yeah, it's square. This is a small amount. I mean, I think it does more. This one just says small, and this one just says... Recovers HP, so I think so. Uh, I'll save that one. Thank you for that. Nothing else. Uh, like I said before, I kind of just ran through here, so I didn't really look at everything. I just made it to the boss, and then I stopped right there. Which should be coming up soon, I think. I really like these, uh, like, special animations you get, like, for the back attack or the parry. They're much better than the ones in, uh, the other Souls games. Were they like this in the, uh, original games? Or did they change that just for... Uh, this version. Some more half moon grass. Okay, and I know you probably can beat this boss but I'm pretty sure I'm not gonna <laughs> do it because I remember it does like more than half of your health uh, with each hit I mean I'll try to like do as best as I can <laughs> but I'm pretty sure I'm not gonna beat this Yep, I'm dead. <laughs> I didn't really want to heal either. Because I know the heals are like, uh, limited. Soul of the Lost withdrawn from its vessel. Let strength be granted so the world might be mended. Soul of the Lost, withdrawn from its vessel. Let strength be granted so the world might be mended. 
so the world might be mended. This is the Nexus. It holds together the northern land of Boletaria. <laughs> Thou canst not quit the Nexus, but the five archstones will guide thee to the outer lands. I like this little effect here. It looks really cool. Alright. Now, what do I do? <laughs> I mean, I guess I'll talk to this dude. Well, you slipped through the fissure too, did you? You came for demon souls. Or to save this land and be remembered as a hero. <laughs> Hunting for demons? Try one of the arch stones. Now go. That is why you came, is it not? To this accursed Boletaria. You came for demon souls. Bah, it's all the same. We're welcome here. As long as we keep slashing them. <laughs> you came for demon souls. We're welcome. <laughs> all right. This is uh, like those other dudes from the other games, the other Dark Souls games. Anybody else here that I can talk to? Oh, I didn't even notice you. Mm, you knew here. Are you here for my services? The name's Baldwin. I'm just an ordinary blacksmith. It's simple. Just bring me all the souls you can in trade. I'll give you weapons, or forge the ones you already have. With your souls, I can eke out a living. And with my weapons, you can go on living. Not a bad deal, eh? Okay. Let's see what you've got. I'm pretty sure I can't buy anything, but it'd be nice to see what you have. All right, not too much right now. now. If you haven't heard, there's another blacksmith at the entrance to Stone Fang Mine. He's an eccentric old man. He knows his trade well. He's the only sane one left in a town of soul-starved men. If you do meet him, no, forget it. That stubborn old nerdy will just chase you off. There aren't enough smithing tools in this temple to handle all the work. Only certain ores can be used to forge weapons. But you'll just have to make do. And be thankful that I can do anything for you at all in this forsaken place. And be thankful that I can do anything. Okay. No interest, eh? Not right no, now. You're not going to last <laughs> long here. Well, thank you. <laughs> Um, let me actually fix those uh, subtitles. I don't actually like the background that they have. Uh, so let me fix that real quick. All right, all fixed. Now let's keep exploring around here. Oh, <laughs> just noticed you. Oh my, how has this happened? Has God abandoned us for King Alant? Failing to show proper respect? Oh, Mbasa. Oh, Mbasa. Okay, that's all you gotta say. Hmm. 
Hmm. Kind of looks a little bit dark in here. I might have to change the brightness a little bit. Maybe. Um, well, you guys let me know how the brightness is on your end. I'll leave it like this for now, and I'll see how it is for me. Okay. It's a pretty big place here. I haven't found anyone else. Hmm. What the heck is this? Can I do anything with it? No. Okay, there was like no one on this floor. What happened to that lady who like brought me back or whatever? I didn't see her down there. I mean, I probably, she probably was down there, but I just didn't see her. Oh, there's an item right there, huh? Well, there's two items, I think. One right here and over there. Do I have to, like, drop down from these things to get that item? These are like the other characters that I made, huh? <laughs> like I said, I was testing out the audio and I um, made like three other characters or something, but they all looked exactly the same. I wanted to make sure the audio was uh, good. So hopefully it is. <laughs> Okay, where's that item that I saw, actually? Well, there's one there. And one there. I don't even know if I can get these items right now. I mean, I could try. Oh, that's not... <laughs> well... I did not mean to do that. <laughs> Alright, let me uh, do that again and not fall this time. Oh, these things are where I can teleport to other places, huh? Hmm. So can I just pick whichever one I want? It doesn't matter which one. And I'll be able to go through it. I mean, I guess. If it lets me. Uh, let me go ahead and grab my things over here. <laughs> okay, let me be more careful this time. Is there an item down here too? I don't know. Okay, let me see. Hmm. 
Okay, I think... Uh, I think I'm done for here. I think I went the wrong way. <laughs> I think I was supposed to go down there. Well, that sucks. I mean, unless I could somehow maneuver my way over there. Nope. Or, yeah. <laughs> I didn't expect to survive that. No moon grass. It's probably a better version of the grass, huh? All HP. Well, that's nice. Now, how can I make it down here without dying? I actually take way less damage than I thought I would. Like, fall damage, I mean. Okay, now where is that other item? <laughs> Otter. I guess I'll try to get that one as well. Right there. Okay. Let me see. Now it's down here, right? Nope. <laughs> Alright, let me try this way. See if this is any better. Hmm, can I even make this? Like, can I even stand on that right there? Oh, I can. Okay. Nice. Well, this was the way then. Wish I would have known that earlier. Um, okay. Please don't fall through there. Okay. And what's this? A soul. Alright, now where can I drop off? These stairs, I guess. Alright. Well, that was fun. <laughs> um, but yeah, what, what happened to that lady? Is she just not here yet? She appeared later on or something? Why there's so many messages here? Are these all like developer messages? What did that say? Okay. So far, there's nothing I don't know from these things. This is just standard stuff in the Souls games. Mm -hmm. Oh, so... So this is a uh, soul form, right? That's why I have that little mark right there in the middle of my house. So how do I get rid of that exactly? Yeah, because in the other games, it was an amber, 
an effigy or I forgot the Dark Souls one thing. Is there like a similar item in this game or is there some other way to do it? Because uh, I would appreciate it if I had all my health. Yeah, I don't know if I'm just not seeing where that lady is or what. Um, but I guess I'll move on somewhere else. Uh, let me take a look at what these things say again. Tower Queen. That one I can't do anything. Shadowman. Chieftain. Covetous King, Digger King, um, let me try this one. Oh, there's one with that dragon. I remember seeing a little bit of this area in someone's video. It's got a nice meal there. Alright, I do see some items over here. Late moon grass. So many different variations of these things. Greatly recovers HP. Is this how we get back? Yeah. Oh, it's another one. Come on. There you go. Now, how did you see me from that far? No, there's actually nothing down here. I don't know why I came back here. Now, do I level up with that lady? Is she like the firekeeper in the other games? Probably. Because I didn't really see any way to level up back there. Oh. <laughs> okay. Take big damage from fire. Makes sense. <laughs> Sorry about that. It's, uh... Kind of satisfying to hit these things. Especially with this PS5 controller. Oh. 
Oh, come on, man. The timing's gonna take a little bit to, uh, of getting used to. I think I heard someone else over there. Huh? Oh, and there's someone else there. The flaming sword. Oh, you have one too. Pine Risen. Now, is that like uh, the Pine Risen from the other Souls games? Wait, when did I get this? Oh, this is like that, uh, the Dark Sign or whatever. Yep. Exactly like the other Souls games. I won't use that right now. I'll probably save that for like a boss or something. Can't actually open this door in any way, huh? Maybe with a lever somewhere? See an item there. Dude with a bow over here. Let me come over here where uh, that dude is not shooting me. Go ahead and assume that I die if I fall down there. Alright, can't break that. Just checking to see if there's any items here. Oh! Almost didn't notice you. Didn't actually mean to get a back attack on that dude. But whatever. Oh yeah, that's the thing I haven't thought about. Is there actually like durability on these things? There is. I mean, it doesn't look like it's going down that fast though, so that's good. It's only gone down 12. How does that work in this game, though? Do I get it, like... When I, like, get to the bonfires or whatever? Or the bonfires of this game? <laughs> or do I actually have to go to the smith? The blacksmith and, like, repair it there? A parry would really help me here. Too early. Could probably do some good damage to one of these dudes. Oh, you got some fire bombs, huh? Come on, one of you do something by yourself. <laughs> And I can parry. Don't attack all at once. There you go. Now I can take care of you easily. Let 
Nice. Oh, there's someone over here. Don't want you bothering me while I'm grabbing these items over here. Another soul. Don't know when I'll use that. And a different weapon. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and stick with this one though. I'm pretty sure that's the uh, same as the other games. Just like a dagger. I'll switch weapons once I find uh, a good looking strength weapon. Oh. Someone's over there. Throwing bombs. Okay, where exactly though? Now where did that come from? Oh, from up there? <laughs> okay, let me uh, just run up here. Okay, that dude on top can't see me yet. Okay, please don't. No. <laughs> Wait up. I need to run over here and heal. I can't heal right there on the stairs. I'll get hit by a firebomb or something. Oh my gosh. Okay, over here that dude shouldn't be able to hit me. I should be able to check my items. I haven't got any bombs or anything, huh? Oh, I did actually. Now can I hit that dude that's like throwing bombs back there? From here? Oh, I don't even need to. <laughs> what the heck was that? That was a little dramatic, don't you think? That wasn't even that far of a drop. That was. <laughs> I actually didn't mean to jump down here with you. How far can this go? Not far enough. What about that? Yep. Nice. How do I get this? Oh, from right here, I think. Do I have to, like, roll from over there or something? a little bit faster no 
Here's that item I wanted. Okay, how the heck do I get this? I don't think I could actually roll through that. Hmm. Or is this an item that I just can't get? Hmm. Yeah, I can't do anything unless I can use a firebomb here. That did nothing. Just wasted my bomb. Hmm. I have no idea. Alright. I'm going to go ahead and uh, leave it here for now. Unfortunately. <laughs> Because I don't have too much more that I can record, I think. Uh, but I will continue. Like, I mean, like, uh, in the next recording. <laughs> but I, I'm going to keep going myself. I feel like playing a little bit more. But thanks for watching. I will see you guys next time.